I rise today to bring to you awareness and support to, believe it or not, an issue that we all support. And it was brought to us for the first time in this chamber by no other than Chicago's newly elected mayor, Mayor Brandon Johnson. In fact, we stood to our feet and rallied together when Mayor Johnson mentioned his support for this issue. In fact, this issue would be supported by all of our residents, neighbors, and constituents if they fully understood it. This issue was discussed in our city and villages committee. We had a standing room only crowd of mayors from across the state, from Rockford to Bloomington to Harvey to Bolingbrook. Every one of them stood up with 100% support of this issue. Unfortunately, this issue will probably not be discussed on this floor. But I encourage you to fully understand it because it's very important to our local communities. It is known by four letters, L, G, D, F. Our local distributed, local government distributed fund. This funding was created over 50 years ago where 10 cents or 10% of every state tax dollar is returned back to our, our local government. Unfortunately, when the recession hit over 10 years ago, we had an emergency funding situation that required us to reduce this 40-year rate from 10% to 6%, which resulted in local communities and governments losing funding of nearly $1 billion a year. Today, over 10 years later, despite claimed budget surpluses, we continue to shortchange our local communities and we owe it to them by restoring the share of revenue distributed back to our local hometowns from 6% to 10%. So as mayor of Lamont, a suburb of Chicago Western Burbs, I understand the importance of these additional funds and I see them at work firsthand every year. So when we go back home next week after this session, nothing would be better than for us to be able to tell our residents that we have reestablished funding and safety in our local communities by 66%. We have reestablished funding in our streets, sidewalks, and infrastructure by 66%. We have reestablished funding in transportation and public health by 66%. So please, as a fellow representative and a local mayor, any responsible state budget should include reestablishing this funding back to 10%. Thank you.